purpose here, but sometimes that's just all great. But this time it kind of comes at a cost, I think. Extra energy in terms of the heat, the moisture that's coming in with this as well probably means some pretty big thunderstorms. It's not a very big time frame, but it's coming through as we go throughout the evening. So take a look now. There's next to nothing going on, but you can tell that the thickest clouds are in the northeast. They're getting pushed away. So the warm front's coming through, allowing some stirring, getting the sun out, and things are warming up. I'll show you temperatures in a bit. And things are starting now. Milwaukee to Green Bay across Lake Michigan. And then they're going to dive to the southeast, and that is our issue as it develops into this more unstable, juicier, stormier air, if you will. So 8 p.m. to midnight is our target zone here. And it'll happen pretty fast, too, because the sun will be out, and the next thing you know, they'll be looking to the northwest to see some dark clouds, and then it'll change very quickly. Damaging winds, hail that could go as big as two inches. It's kind of a ripe situation, if you will, good ingredients uh, for some larger hail this time around. An isolated tornado is not out of the question either. Storms again moving from the northwest to the southeast, probably about 30 miles an hour. Look at the temperature change. Fort Huron's at 48. Metro's at 65. Well, downtown it's 54. Ipsy's at 71. Adrian's 69. You've hit 70 today. Howell's at 70. So a strong warm front making a big difference here in the energy in the atmosphere. South to southwest winds now at 7, 73% for the humidity. The pressure is falling as the storm system moves in. So this evening, 60s. Storms after 8, they could be severe. Again, wind and hail, the biggest concern, but can't rule out the possibility of a tornado here. The storms end probably around midnight to 1 o'clock west to east, somewhere in there, 51 overnight. And then tomorrow, look at this, back to lots of sunshine, a warmer day, 67. Well, warmer than most of today has been, even though we get a northwest wind, that's dry air coming in. Kind of cool, huh? Temperatures around 50 or lower Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Easter, Sunday. There's a chance for some showers as well. So this warmth this evening.